Welcome. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to Ryan's channel. For the right reasons 2016. I'm Ryan. Um, you know, uh, it's the month of August, right? So uh, for anyone that's new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button. This is absolutely free. Um, you know, as you can see, yeah, I do have that kind of white on one side of the face and kind of dark on the other side of the face. So hopefully that, that doesn't weird you guys out. Um, you know, again, I'm trying to play with the lighting, um, and that sort of thing. So, um, you know, and I am watching myself. I'm getting used to watching myself on camera. Um, you know, so I'm always camera ready. You never know, right? You never know. You never know. Um, you know, anyone that you meet could be a boss, could be an employee, right? So one thing I've learned is never burn bridges. And, um, you know, you never, you never know when you're going to need to lean on someone or they're going to need to lean on you. Right. And so, you know, again, we're all in this together. Um, so again, you know, new followers, uh, you know, thanks again for joining me. It means a lot. It really does. Um, you know, I can't do this without you. Please, uh, please ask, um, you know, any questions or, uh, feel free to give comments, um, on anything, right. Um, that, you know, I'm going to discuss today. Uh, I think the video will be pretty short because I have to pick my son up. Um, you know, he's still at daycare, so, uh, I just, I felt enthusiastic about, you know, um, like getting this, getting this in. I got my meal in, you know, I got my workout in earlier. I got my cut, so I'm, I'm feeling pretty good, you know, um, and so I'm, I'm pretty pumped. I'm ready, you know, uh, so, so yeah, you know, it's, it's month of August, right? And I told um, some of my clients this week, right. That, um, you know, my video is probably going to be about training today. Um, you know, and, and, you know, all things pertaining to training and, uh, and how I feel, um, about the differences between training and exercise. Um, you know, I feel that, Training is exercise with a purpose, right? You know what you're going to be doing. You have a plan. You act on it. You don't leave until you're just, you break, right? Um, not literally, right? But, but, you know, if you feel like you could have done more, then turn right back around, march back in and do a little bit more, right? You want to give it all you got. Um, and I'm here to say it's, it's, it's working. It really is. It's working for me. Um, you know, I hit a 225 deadlift on Monday. That was, that was a goal for, um, December and I hit that this week. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm amazed. I mean, I really am, you know, nutrition is on point. Um, you know, my training is on point. Uh, you know, everything is just firing in all cylinders and it's, it's great. It's, it's green for go. Um, you know, but I think what I'll be doing is talking about, well, first, like, I want to talk about the shirt, right? I like to talk, I try to wear a different shirt, um, you know, things that I enjoy doing, um, right there on my chest, right? And so it says, choose your, choose your weapon, right? I love playing chess. Um, before I go into the pieces and, and why, how I feel about it, I want to say thank you for the, uh, to the following people, uh, my father-in-law, Rick Hammonds and my dad, Anthony Fazio, who, who, um, you know, got me thinking about playing the game. Um, you know, thought that I had the mind for it, that sort of thing. And I, and I couldn't thank you. It's, it's a great game. It's, I mean, it would be the game I play, um, you know, if there was no power, uh, you know, and, you know, I mean, shoot, if I didn't have an opponent, I would play myself, right? Me, myself, and I would be, would be, uh, would be playing a game, um, you know, and, uh, you know, great thing, great, great thing is, is that I always be winning, right? So, you know, me, myself, and I, and so, um, you know, it's great, and I'm not a grandmaster by any means, I'm just, you know, someone that plays, I'm lucky to get, like, a move ahead, um, but, you know, it's, it's an awesome game. It really is, you know, and, um, I couldn't, uh, you know, have thank 
thank those uh, those following people for getting me to play. Um, and I downloaded an app and I played it. You know, it showed me how to move and I just memorized the patterns and you know, you know, I feel like each and every piece, pawn, queen, king, bishop, rook, knight, um, you know, they, they all have their, their strengths and their weaknesses, but fear that queen, right? Fear that queen. She's, she's ruthless, right? She's, she's quick acting, um, you know, so never... Never make female, like, you know, a female, you know, the lioness upset, right? Don't fear the lion, fear the lioness, um, you know, especially in the wild, right? With the, uh, you know, with the lions and, you know, lions and tigers and bears, right? Um, but yeah, it's, you know, it's, it's, you know, they will just, err. so anyway, um, you know, I, I enjoy the game, like I said, and, um, you know, and I feel that every piece is shaped to the unique move, the movement that they do. So, for example, the pawn, right, moves up and down, single space, can't go diagonal or back, right? Um, if that pawn can make it across the, the board without being taken out, it can get promoted and you can turn it into any piece you want. Right, so that's pretty sweet. That's that's kind of rare, um, you know. And the queen, she can move anywhere she wants at any time. So watch out, right? Um, you know, she's 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 never underestimate your opponent. For you know, seriously. Uh, then you know we have the we have the king, right? And we want to protect him because once he's done or he has no other moves left. He's cornered. That's it, right? Check, checkmate. Boom. It's it's over. Um, you know. So enough said, really, right? And next you have the uh, the assassin, right? And and you look at like a warrior and how they, you know, they do that diagonal chop. They move in that direction, right? And there's a little slip there, like 45 degree angle, that allows them to do you know, go across the board like that. So I try to take out those knights as quick as possible. Um, I'll get to the knight last, right? But, um, you know, um, yeah. And so anyway, so you have the rook, right? And the rook, it looks like the castle it has like the end, the towers at the end, right? So it looks like a castle, if you're wondering. Um, you know, it has grooves in it, notches, and it can go vertical or horizontal, but not diagonal. It can move as many spaces um, across the board as it wants, so watch out for that one too. Um, and finally, the knight, right? The my my brother-in-law calls it the horsey, Josh Hammond. Um, you know, one of the smartest guys I know, um, and uh, I'll I'll be talking about him when I make a video all about how I feel about the book Ready Player One um, and the author uh, Ernest Cline. Um, amazing book just fantastic right on par with uh the godfather by mario puzo but that's another that's another topic for another day finally yeah so that knight right it's shaped of an l and so it moves in like a 90 degree um you know uh kind of a, a circular pattern right and so you know up and then to the left up and to the right and it moves around so you know control the center of the board and you pretty much got the game. Um, just pay attention to your opponent's pieces. Um, you know, don't let those pawns get promoted because you don't want multiple queens running on the board because it's it it would be chaos. So anyway, so that was my little thing, my little segment, how I felt about chess, right? And um, so it's fantastic to play. Um, if you're wondering how to play, right, um, I can always make a video on how to do that, um, you know, with these hands right here, right? Uh, I could pan down the camera and then, you know, I can, I can show you how to play there. So please, you know, if you have questions or, um, you know, yeah. and by the way, great movie, just before I go over to the other thing, um, Searching for Bobby Fischer. 
Um, fantastic, uh, fantastic movie. It really is. A child prodigy, right? Grandmaster. 20 moves ahead. I mean, just insane. Um, and so, anyway, but that's, that's that, right? And so, today's video... Today's video will all will be about the TRX suspension trainer and why I love this thing so much, right? Total body resistant exercises. If you're wondering what the TRX stands for, it was developed by a former Navy SEAL, Randy Hetrick. Um, I probably will be posting this video to TRX and I just want, you know, maybe one day, uh, you know, I would like to meet him and maybe even get some of my straps signed because I have this model here and a Pro Trainer 4 model uh, for trainers uh, to teach clients, uh, you know, and that sort of thing. You may have seen them, um, you know, and it's fantastic. You know, it has everything that you need. It's a gym in a bag. It really is. Now I'm going to hold on to this. Everything on this exists for a, a, a reason. There is not one thing on here that exists for just aesthetics only, right? Um, you know, it's 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 fantastic, right? It it deals with your own body weight. Um, you know, you can place this on your door. You can place this on any horizontal anchor point that can support your weight. I believe it's been tested up to a thousand pounds before it snaps. So you know, you could just try to break this thing and it won't break. Right, like a Navy SEAL, um, you know, and I'm I'm so glad that Randy, you know, he you know he majored in uh, uh, you know in business, the MBA. I believe he went to Stanford for that. Originally tried to pitch the idea to other clubs, and they didn't they didn't accept it. Like, oh, I don't want this in our club, you know. I'm glad he didn't listen because you know this really this really transformed my life, and I use this. Um, great ab works, uh, workouts. And so I'm not going to be going through workouts and that sort of thing today. I just want to talk about, you know, and get this involved in the community because this is fantastic. The quality of it, it's great presentation. Um, and again, I'm not making any, any, any money off this whatsoever. I'm just, you know, I, I just, I find the value in this and, you know, it is, for home exercise equipment, I mean, there's 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 no um, no comparison. I mean, it's fantastic, right? So you start coupling this in with like a heavy bag, or medicine ball slams, or whatever. Those clients that you know that I teach on this, they know it's intense, right? It's intense, you know. And it started for me suspension. Suspension training, right? That's what that is. And it's been, by the way, it's been, there's been studies done on it. Suspension training, resistance training, whether one is better than the other. Well, the suspension trainer and the resistance training, I mean, it's still, you still get that resistance and subjects still uh, got the results, right? And so, um, you know, there are, there is scientific evidence to support them. Um, I've taken a few classes myself in San Francisco. Um, and I want to thank my wife for that education. Um, literally because she booked the hotels, she made the travel arrangements, told me where to be, right? Like, like all of that stuff. And I couldn't have done that without her. So, um, you know, thank you very much, Jessica, for that. Um, you know, it, it means a lot, and uh, for some reason, it's difficult to say face to face. Um, you know, but I'm, I'm, you know, maybe when you watch this video, right, uh, it'll, it'll hit, hit home and penetrate there. So, um, you know, I, I have a lot to thank you for that, right? Um, you know, I'm, you know, and so yeah, and so you know, I took some of those classes and. Um, it was, it was, I mean, it was great. I took a suspension training, a group training, and a rip training class. That's different from the suspension trainer. Uh, rip training is different, more asymmetrical loads, one single-sided movements, uh, great for sports, 
right? Golfing and uh, tennis and uh, lacrosse and things like that, right? I mean, top athletes, they're gonna, it's gonna be dangling, maybe blurry when they're featuring something in a locker room with, the, with, the, with an athlete, right? That's what that is. So it's, uh, it's fantastic, it really is. Uh, PRX, um, you know, and I, I teach a demo on Tuesdays at our health club, and so if you wanna ask more about that, please ask, uh, you know, in the comments section, and I'd be glad to help you with that. Um, you know, maybe guide you through some of the movements and that sort of thing. Um, you know, it's, uh, I feel that suspension, this, this suspension trainer, you know, is, has got it right, because there are other suspension trainers out there. I mean, you know, straps hanging down, weird little foot cradle thingies, but, you know, I feel like this is a product that got it right, they have education behind it. They got backing behind it. Um, you know, so Randy, Mr. Randy Hedrick, thank you very much for that. Um, you know, it, 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 it humbles me, like, on a daily basis. Uh, some of the stuff that, I, that I've seen, um, you know, the, the, the move of the weeks, right? Um, you know, those have been inspiring. And, and you know, your classes are fantastic. And hopefully one day... Um, I get to shake your hand and say that you've, you've really, you have no idea how much of an impact you've made in my life, um, both, uh, you know, personally and professionally. So thank you for that. Um, you know, and thank you for your service and uh, sacrifice, um, you know, and making that, right? Having those materials in your bag to make it. So um, anyway, as you know, I respect right my my quality products and and you know i don't take it for granted and so it's 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 fantastic um you know it's uh and yeah again it's your own body weight right and there are i'll just go through some of the the foundational movements right you've got you've got the plank right you've got the you got the plank the pull the hinge the um the push the squat and the lunge, right? Um, I might be leaving one out, but I'm not going to go through that. You can go ahead and rewind it if you want, but they call it the move seven, seven foundational movements. Plank, pull, and hinge is the first three. Um, and so no matter how you do the exercises, like a squat, for example, right? Um, you know, much like sitting into a, a chair, right? So it's not a deep knee bend. Um, I fear that... Uh, now, some people are still using that in, in you know, conversation, and I, I don't agree with that old, um, you know, because it's, it, it's deceiving in my opinion. So a squat makes more sense to me. You're sitting back, you're unloading joints, you're not hurting yourself, um, and so that's what it's all about, right? Because you, you get in and out of your car, that's a squat, put your seatbelt on, that's rotation, um, you know, uh, you know, you're driving, right, you know, and... Uh, you know, all of that. There's lots of complicated movements that have to uh, you know, happen, um, you know, uh, involuntarily, right? Just You just snap into it and you do it for you in order to do that. So the, the body is a fantastic, the best machine on the planet. It really is, you know. Um, so, you know, take care of it, right? Take care of it. Appreciate it. And it will, it will take care of you, right? Be one of those that say, that show everything, that say nothing, that say little, but mean so much, instead of those who say so much, but mean very little, right? Um, I want to be the former, not the latter, right? So I'm, I'm, you know, I'm not perfect, far, right? Far from perfect, but, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm working on it, and I'm accepting things, and I'm, I'm trying to, uh, to get better at that and, and you know I hate myself for some of the, the action reactions that happen sometimes but I try to uh, uh, you know correct that to um, be a good role model for my son right who this channel you know really was started for to um, you know see see his dad go through this journey you know when he's really really young to see myself someday look back at this video you know, and hopefully it's transformed and changed some lives. So, you know, suspension training, TRX, I mean, it's, it's fantastic. Um, 
you know, it's it's relative. I mean, it's the the price is reasonable, right? And um, you know, it's it's in every major sporting locker room and and you know, gym from coast to coast and you know, ocean to ocean. Um, so it's 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 great. It really is. Uh, you know, and depending on the movements that you do, that you make, the the length of the straps, um, you know, go with the movements. You know, you've got the over short position. Real quick, I'm not going through any exercises. I just want to show you here. Let's see that. So you got the you got the over short position for like your inverted rows, your pull ups, right? Your shoulder. You know, um, that sort of stuff, right? Drawing a blank here. Um, you know, a little more caffeine, I think. And then you got the the full short position, right? With strap lengths, and that's for like your bicep curls, um, you know, and your rows and that sort of thing. Um, and the great thing is, it's, it's it's always attached by the anchor point, so you want to stay within that vector or that pendulum, right? And so you can walk it all the way underneath the inverted rows, whatever you want to do. And then come all the way back up again without having to struggle to stand up and, and, and that sort of thing, right? Which I've seen, um, you know, and so it's just, you know, you can become part of it, right? Um, then you got mid length, right? The mid length position and there's little knots, not there's little, little dashes there, right? The stitching, one, two, and three. That's for strap length, if you're wondering. Um, you know, the mid length is for like squats and, and um, you know, Romanian deadlifts and, um, you know, uh, excuse me, um, burps, uh, squats and, uh, you know, RDLs, Romanian deadlifts, uh, you know, um, uh, you know, and other lower body exercises. And experts say that, hey, if you don't know what strap length to be, then, you um, you know, you probably want to be at mid length. Ninety percent of the exercises can be performed there. Um, um, so if you forget, hey, mid length, right? So stitching number two, uh, and then final. Well, and then you've got the fourth, which is mid calf, right? So these right here are foot cradles, right? These are where your feet go. Um, the newer models have Velcro, and you can adjust it to your own foot. Right, so if you're at home, you can remove your shoe, right, and it'll be exactly you know how you left it to be for you, right? Um, for kids, right, you loop it in, um, you know, for their tiny foot. But any age group, you know, in my experience, could be doing this. Um, it won't. We don't want to do too much training because it can uh, impact ligaments and joints, and and you know, and, and we're growing and stuff as children, right? So you want to be careful of that, but. This is super safe to do, um, you know, and I support, I support this. I always will support this. Um, and then eventually I'd love to fit in my TRX uh, shirts again um, and lead classes. You know, I would love to be in the position to do a move of the week for, um, you know, like right now we're doing uh, a TRX demo Tuesdays, right, at our health club, and it's just for like 15 minutes, I'll take it, right? I mean, it's, it's, it's a good exposure, good experience, new people are showing up, I'm really excited about it, um, you know, and I just want people to get over, well, I don't know how to adjust it, and I don't know what this means, and this and that, so, you know, so next time you see these straps hanging on your local, uh, you know, your gym, right, your club, whatever, this right here is called an adjustment tab, right? And there's a little little notch here so you can go all the way up and all the way down easier. This right here with my thumbs on is a little buckle. They call this a barrel lock or a cam gear. I like to say barrel lock. It sounds a little bit better than cam gear. It's a little bit more confusing that way. And so you just bring it, right? And then you can slide it all the way down. And then you can grab the adjustment tab and slide it up, right? All the way to the top, all the way down. Right, so louder the sound, more confidence you got, right? Um, so, you know, and then finally, oh, uh, 
jumping all over the place. I'm, you know, you can tell I'm really super excited about this. Lots of, lots of thoughts. I gotta. Lots of times, my brain thinks a lot faster than my mouth. So, you know, and I know I have to go pick up my son. Um, I'm a little late, but it's it's important, and I'm glad that, um, you know, I'm, I'm able to, to to share this with you. It means a lot to me, and uh, it could it could truly change your life. It really can. So, um, you know, we have the uh, the mid calf level, right? And so it would be towards the calf right at the bottom, or take the handle and place it mid center knee, and that should be where you're where you're at. So with me, it's about a third between notch three and notch two stitching pattern. Right, you can see the yellow on there. Um, so that that works for me, right? And that is for your ab exercises, right? Your abdominal exercises, it's great. I never use the ab crunching machine. Uh, I might do cable pull downs and stuff. Uh, you know, um, with that Y handle, uh, kind of looks like a, a braid, right? A thick braid. People use it for tricep extensions. Um, I, you know, so, yep, there's that. And then finally, full length, right? And so, similarly to the fully short position, right? When the straps, the adjustment tab is all the way to the top, when you can go all the way underneath and do your thing, when you're all the way down, right at the bottom part, you slide it all the way down to the bottom part. Now you're able to do exercises close to the ground without actually being on the ground. And and if you need uh, uh, less, you know, for it to be less intense, right? Because you want to earn the right to move to another position, right? Don't let ego get in the way, right? There's no place for ego in the weight room in your training. Um, it's probably the exercise versus the training. No ego. Eliminate that. Take that out of the equation, right? Um, so anyone's going to school, right? Hey, you get equations. You get that, right? So solve for X, right? Um, but, you know, the uh, the full length, yeah, and it's, it's, it's for, like, deep angle chest presses. You can do front squats with it, bring the straps underneath the arms. Um, you can get that deep angle push-up, um, you know, and so you can do ab, ab rollout stuff with it. Um, you can, what I do is I place my forearm through the foot cradle, right? And then I do, I do rollouts with it, right? I do crunches with it. Great for cyclists um, who need a low center of gravity, um, you know, because core strength is super important. And we talk core, right? But what does it actually mean? Well, TRX teaches that, in, in I, and I think, and I agree, right, because it's how we move, right? Collarbone, clavicle to mid-thigh is the core, right? So, so chest, obliques, abs, back, lower back, traps, all that stuff, shoulder, right? That all moves in one direction, that rotation, right? And so you move those hips, um, and, then, and then you'll rotate, right? That transverse plane. Um, and so, you know, you can, you can get as, as crazy and, you know, wild um, with it, or you can keep it very simple, right? And I always recommend, you know, keep it simple, keep it basic, right? Don't overcomplicate it, um, you know, and, and, and just adjust them, right? So over short, full short, mid-length, mid-calf, and finally full length. And all exercises that you can think of, you can do it on that, right? So if you can't make it to the gym, for example, great thing to do. Just throw it over the door. It comes with a door jam. You can buy it through the company's website. Um, you know, I'm not going to bring that up. Ask questions, comments, and I'll, and I'll go ahead and type that in later. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, my voice is going. I talked a lot today. I think I've educated and motivated people today, so it was worth it. If I lose my voice, it was worth it, right? If I made one, one difference all week, it was worth it, right? So, you know, I, I firmly believe that. I stand by it. I support that. Um, and I mean that, right? I try to be transparent. I try to be honest. I try, you know, I, I bleed over it if I could. Uh, a few times I have, actually. I give a little. Definitely a lot of sweat, 
tears, right? Uh, I haven't cried almost to the point, but I've given some blood sometimes on accident, right? So, um, you know, I, I'm, I'm okay. Everything's fine. Uh, just little mucks and stuff, and I got calluses and things, but th those are those are those are war stories, right? And so, you know, hey, get in there, do your thing, right? Headphones in, I find it working for me. Um, you know, any questions and stuff that you have, I, I'm going to talk about the workouts and stuff later on. Um, you know, uh, and go through go through some exercises, some workouts. So hopefully. This video was very informative, and I wanted to talk about how I love and appreciate this product, and I stand by it. And, uh, you know, maybe someday I will be teaching you, um, you know, the uh, fundamentals of suspension training, and it could make a super impact. Clients have. They have them. They've introduced them to their family. So, you know, um, I won't mention any names, but some of my clients may provide comments. So uh, if I can use your names, I will. Uh, but I will, uh, I will keep, I will keep your names out um, for privacy, um, and you know, and I respect that, and I respect you, um, and so you know, be hungry and be humble, right? Make sure you're in it for the right reasons. 2016, um, you know, and uh, click on that discussion tab, and then comment section and then boom you should be able to type the comments a lot of people are unclear on how to do that so you know that's there all right so uh enjoy your your friday your weekend right it's a new month a new you let's get to work all right everyone have a great great weekend again um you know please hit like please hit the subscribe button provide comments need that con constructive criticism it is my channel as much as your channel. Um, and again, thank you, uh, Slim, for my magnificent cut today. I appreciate you and everything that you do because um, you know about Bowtie Barbershop, the video I had before this, actually two videos before this. Uh, and so, um, you know, they played it today at their shop and, and I thought it was very, very, it was, it was a good moment. It was a, a priceless moment, so it was great. All right, so again, um, have a great weekend, um, you know, and make sure you're in for the right reasons, 2016, and I will talk to you next time. All right. Cheers.